Good morning, guys. I am Quaja Quick. And my husband and I are off to the gym. So that's why I'm looking like a little bum right now with this little baseball cap on and my North Face fleece. But yeah, um, we definitely needed <laughs> some motivation this morning um, to go to the gym. It's been a while. The last time we've gone to the gym was before we went on vacation to Florida and that was in August yeah it's been a minute I'm trying to tone up my body um, everyone says oh you don't need to tone up oh you don't need to do this and that and I'm just like well as for me I don't feel comfortable with how I look and before I moved here to Atlanta I was smaller than I was right now. Um, I noticed that, you know, in some places it was good, some places it was bad. The good parts was my butt, <laughs> and the not so great parts was in my stomach area. I wanna get, you know, tone up, you know, on that, and, you know, as far as my legs go, they're pretty okay, but um, I, I just wanna, you know, not only just get my body uh, somewhat back to what it was but just on like a healthy level um just try and maintain you know working out and stuff uh, i just needed that motivation this morning and we got up uh it's currently 801 right now um just gonna try and be in, in there for an hour just gonna, you know try and do our thing in there and then um hopefully we can get in there tomorrow morning as well If you are that type of person that needs motivation, um, here's a couple tips that you can use. Um, number one would probably be like, put a reminder in your phone. I always put reminders in my phone. Uh, it could be anything. It could be something so simple as, you know, mail out this letter tomorrow, or, you know, call my mom about X, Y, Z. Um, definitely try and put a reminder in your phone to remind you, hey, you need to go to the gym. Second, and I know it sounds crazy, but set your alarm clock. If you are willing to go to the gym, let's say tomorrow at 10 o'clock a.m., put your alarm clock on for 10 a.m. so that when, you know, it got forbid if you do forget the night before, oh, I forgot I have to go to the gym, it wakes you up, you know, that could be your little motivation there. That could be like, okay, you got to get up for 10 a.m. because you're going to the gym. Simple as that. And then also, it's always good um, to have like a partner or a friend to encourage you and to get you up and to get you going if this is something that you really want to do. Um, I know it's simple as going to the gym. It's nothing major, but um, you know, if you're that type of person that is willing to get yourself on the right track and live a healthier lifestyle, um, Definitely express that to a friend or to a family member, to someone that you really trust and, you know, someone who you really, you know, care about. They'll try and encourage you and get you motivated and get you up and going to do whatever it is that you're trying to do to get yourself on the right track. Those are just, you know, three little good tips to use. Um, I've definitely used them before. And he's you know willing to go to the gym as well because he feels like he needs to get in as well so it works out for me so um it's just you know the getting up part <laughs> is what's hard but um once you your first time going once you go trust me you'll want to go after because you'll feel so great you'll feel so you know alive and just so motivated after that so um that's all I really have for you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and work out and I will get back to you guys when we finish to let you know how I felt and how great it was. And yeah, I'll check you guys later. So we're back from the gym and um, you know, it was okay. Uh, like I said, I haven't been in there since August. So, you know, I 
just was just trying to find, you know, just do things at my own pace. I didn't want to um, overexert myself. All I did was I was on the treadmill for an hour. I'm just walking um, in between. I would like run and then stop because I'm like, oop, can't take no more. It's just a lot. Um, but yeah, I would just run for a couple seconds and then just continue to just, you know, fast walk on the treadmill. And then afterwards, my husband and I, we went into the room. It was at Planet Fitness. So if you know Planet Fitness, there's a room where you're able to just, you know, do crunches. And they have the little, um, the yoga mat and all the other tools to use for uh, working out. I didn't want to overexert myself because, you know, I haven't been in a long time. Um, so I was just working at my own pace. I know probably the next time I will go a little harder um, I'll definitely probably get back on the treadmill But as far as the crunches because I am working on my stomach um, I definitely want to do more of those and um, use more of the things that they have in there to uh, Work on that specific area. Other than that um, You know I'm just looking at other people and I'm like, oh my gosh, you know, how can I be like that? How can I you know start sweating a lot and you know, just overexerting myself like they were. And, you know, when I think about it, it's just like, you don't need to be like them, you know? They're probably in here working on something totally different than you are. Or they probably come in here every day. So, you know, they're, it's a lot more easier for them. So, I need to just stop thinking about other people and looking at other people and just start thinking about myself and what's good for me. Think about you, write out your goals, what you're trying to work on, so that when you do get to the gym, or even when you're working out, working out at home, because you can work out at home, I don't like to do it, I like to be at the gym, I don't know why, I just like to use, um, you know, the uh, equipment that they have there, instead of working out at home, I get distracted when I'm at home. Plan out your goals, write out your goals, and um, what you plan to achieve for the day, or for the time that you are working out, and, you know, once you do that, then you'll be okay. So, I hope you have a great day, and thank you for tuning in. If you have any questions, write them in your comments. If you like this video, subscribe, because I will be doing a lot more videos um, about anything, because this is a lifestyle um, blog that I'm doing, well, vlog, if I must say. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give me a thumbs down. I take any criticism, you know, criticism. I learn from it and I grow from it. I appreciate um, anything, any comment or anything that you give me. So, um, you guys have a blessed day and I'll talk to you guys soon.